In this video I'm going to show you how to quickly transform faces into simplified but powerful retro WPAP hybrid style portrait posters. Feel free to use any photo you like. Make sure image resolution is 150 pixels per inch. To check its resolution, go to image and image size. Image resolution is 150 pixels per inch. Its width and height can be anywhere between 1000 and 2000 pixels each. If the photo you are using doesn't have a white or black background, you'll need to make the background white or black. To do this, unlock the background and open the properties panel. Click Remove Background. Photoshop automatically makes a layer mask of our subject. We'll make a new layer below it by Ctrl plus clicking the new layer icon. We'll fill the empty layer with white or black, depending on the characteristics of our subject. If your foreground and background colors aren't black and white respectively, press D on your keyboard. If they're inverted, press X. To fill the empty layer with white, press Ctrl plus Delete. To fill it with black, press Alt plus Delete. We'll convert a visible image into a smart object, so we can modify it non-destructively and allow us to replace the subject with another without having to redo most of the effects. To do this, shift-click the subject layer to make it active as well and click the icon at the upper, right. Click Convert to Smart Object. Go to Filter. Filter Gallery. Open the Artistic Folder and click Cutout. Make the number of levels 8, the Edge Simplicity 6, and the Edge Fidelity 1. We need to reveal more details in the eyes. To do this, make a copy of the layer by pressing Ctrl plus J. Double-click Filter Gallery in the copy to open it and make the Edge Simplicity 4. Next, we'll reveal back the simpler version while keeping the detailed eyes. We'll make an inverted layer mask next to the copy by Alt plus clicking the layer mask icon. Select Pencil Tool. We want white to be our foreground color. Open the pencil picker and pick a hard round point. Don't worry about the size, I'll show you how to adjust its size in a moment. Make its hardness 100% and its opacity 100%. To adjust your pencil size, make sure the caps lock key is off and press the right or left bracket key on your keyboard. Draw over the areas of the irises and the pupils to reveal back the less simplified copy of our subject's face. Click the Adjustment Layer icon, click Color Lookup. Click Load 3D LUT. Feel free to apply any of them to your image. For this image, I'll choose Bleach Bypass. Open the Adjustments panel. Open Single Adjustments and click Levels. Change Input Shadows Level. Doing this essentially darkens the darkest tones of our image. Thanks for watching.